we'll go to the next interesting question which talks about variation and it talks about positional cyclical and temporal variations are most commonly analyzed using which tool and the four options that we have here are run charts control chart histograms and multivary chart in order for you to answer this question you actually need to know all these four charts uh, before we do that let me take a minute to talk about positional cyclical and temporal variation what do we mean by that and then most probably you should be able to answer the question based on that now we'll talk about uh, what is positional variation positional variation in essence is talking about within unit variation uh, for example i have a uh, a molded component and I am um, injection molding and I have uh, four different cavities so the variation which is there in the parts which are coming from each of those four different cavities essentially talks about a within unit variation and which is what a positional variation is all about right so that could be one aspect that I would study the other aspect that I could study was the cyclical if you remember the question so the cyclical talks about anything that has a pattern in it now it could be a variation which is there between units that is from my first shot to my second shot in an injection molding or from my second shot to the third shot so the variation which is there from one cohort to another cohort so that's a cyclical variation that i'm trying to study and the third is temporal variation which is something to do with time we always try to tag time as um, a greatest clue uh, regarding any source of variation for us because if we are able to attach time to it we will be able to easily catch what happened at that point of time and quite often time is also a source of variation like for example shift there could be a distinctive behavior of people working in a night shift as compared to that of people in the day shift if we talk about which of the options here are most suited for analyzing these types of variation you could study these types of variation using any tool right but the best fit for this question is a multivary chart the multivary chart is actually meant for catching sources of variation of these three different types that is variation which is there within between and time related variation so the best answer actually is a multivary chart it's a classical question and a classical answer